Hey love bugs, it's Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed today. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, welcome, namaste. Love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are yet to come for you. And if you have not already, like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when your girl is about to upload her next video. And if you feel like you resonate with my video, go ahead and drop me a line or two. I love to get the positive feedback. And if you feel like you enjoy what you heard, please like and even share. It'll greatly be appreciated. And thank you so much for stopping by my channel and seeing what's up. And for my returning subs, as always, much love to you. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are yet to come for you also. And thank you so much for taking your time out to come and see about my video today. And today, my meditation music, if you can listen, if you can hear it in the background, is called uh, Stress Relief, uh, Calm, Steady, Yoga, and Spa Meditation Music for Sleep. So I will post that link in the description box below. It is, sounds so relaxing. Love bugs. I mean, I'm just trying not to sit up here and go to sleep because I'm relaxing. And it's like... That, that music is just, I don't know about you, but there's sometimes I just sit here and it, it's just, it doesn't even really have to have anything going on and it's just like I like to listen to music, especially when it has something to do with the ocean. You can hear the seagulls in the background. It sounds so calming. So, you know, that's why I love, you know, just put them in the background of my videos because it's just like I want you to be calm when you come listen to my videos and stuff like that. But anyways, my video is about Twin Flame 101. Hey, hey Oka is the sign of awakening. I don't know with um, all, like with the eclipse and all the stuff that's been happening for the last four, four or five months or whatever. Um, a lot of people have been awakening. It's just like me. I've been a while, but it's just like going through my Kundalini uh stages and still go through awakening stages it's just like you know they come in waves they come in spurts you might be okay for another minute and next thing you know your you know emotions are all over the place you can be triggered you know it doesn't take much for you to even get aggravated and it's just like learning more and more about stuff about yourself it's just like when people come to these videos and they're seeing them there it's like a lot of them i'm hearing you know they awaken and they're uh they're just they're just figuring out what they are you know trying to figure out you know why am i isolate myself why are my emotions you know so heightened why am i able to feel other people's feelings why am i able to you know feel their vibrations and all these thousands of questions just go through their head like why is this really going on but it's just the reason why you're going through this, you know, at this certain time. I'm still studying on to figure out why. But, you know, you go through a, a spurt where it just seems like you have Friday the 13th walking on the back of your back. <laughs> you know, you could be losing somebody. You could lose your job. You could lose a loved one. You know, and it could be just like a divorce or a breakup or anything like that. But everything is happening for you for a reason. You're awakening and you might feel like everything's falling apart. But usually when it's falling apart everything's starting to come back together for you so you have to pay attention pay attention to the signs pay, pay attention to the synchronicities and things will work out just fine for you you know you need to learn more about yourself and there's a reason why you were given this gift and that's something that you have to find out on your own on the reason why you were given this gift but we have to go through all these things we have to deal with narcissistic people so we can be able to help them change i don't understand how we can do that because sometimes narcissistic people will not change unless they want to so i'm still figuring these things out so it's just when we're going through these things you're going through your awakening trust me you're going through these awakenings for a reason you might have nauseous you might uh, have nauseousness you might have headaches that's what your third eye open your penal glands messing with you you might be having hot and cold flashes there can be times where you're getting downloads and you might feel chills going up and down your spine or up and down your back like you know somebody walked over your grave and you will feel all these things you might feel you might even hear voices in your head and you're not crazy it's just you're you're catching on to other people's thoughts and processes so if any of those signs are happening that means you're having an awakening 
So, I will talk to you later. I wasn't trying to hold you up. Everybody be responsible at everything you do. I will keep you in my prayers, and I hope to, hopefully you will definitely keep me in yours. And I will see you in my next video. Like and subscribe if you have not already. Drop a line or two. I would love to hear from you. And much love. Send out as much love and frequency and um, positive vibes as you possibly can. And I will see you on my next video. Peace. And be wild.